everyone welcome to my youtube channel this is my first video and in this video i'm gonna show you how to create a smooth and beautiful animation to show both your dark mode and light mode designs the reason i'm creating this video is because so many people in the directs of my instagram page asked me how did i do it and i thought it would be good to create a video on youtube to show them how to uh, create this really simple uh, and easy animations so to start you have to uh, open your figma or x0 or whatever you're working with uh, we have two artboards here one uh, contains the light mode design and one contains the dark mode they have to be in the same position in the same uh, background color uh, so there's a, a lot of difference so you just have to uh, cho choose them and export them i choose uh, 2x because uh, it has a better quality when it goes to After Effects. I'm just going to export it real quick. Okay. And I'm going to open my After Effects. Here you have to create a new composition. Name it as your project. And that's good. Everything's okay. Now, you have to drag and drop those pictures that you took export of them to here and then drag them to here okay as you can see they're a bit big for your compositions because and that's because you exported them to x you just have to press s and change this to 50. okay that's amazing so here you have to decide which one of these pictures you want to be in the background and which one do you want them to be uh, with the wiggle effect here I choose the light mode to be in the background and the dark mode to be to have the wheel effect. So to start you have to create a shape around your composition and then rotate it like uh, 45 degrees. Be careful uh, that it contains all of your composition uh, because we want to have a really nice uh, well animation here. So. You just put it here outside of your composition press p and give it position right where it is okay and then you just do this and yeah that's pretty much good okay you just put it there choose your uh, two keyframes and just press f9 to create smoothness now we're gonna do the wiggle effect uh, you have to choose contents here, you see that, and press add, here it's the vegan paths, you choose it, and then, uh, well, here is a little bit tricky because uh, you have to, uh, well, work with it to create a, a good wiggle and like it has to suit your design, so I'm just gonna do this with it. Make sure uh, you put this on smooth because if you don't do that, it's going to be edgy and it's not going to look very nice. Two wiggle per second. I'm just going to put this to three. Let's see how does it look. Okay, it's a bit slow. That's because of the two wiggles per second. I'm just going to put it 10. Yeah. Add a little bit of detail to it. Okay, it has a lot of details now. <laughs> okay, this looks pretty much good to me. Okay, now let's just do this real quick so we have this on repeat mode i'm just gonna press n here so we're gonna have to see this repeatedly okay now to create uh to give this uh, effect to our own picture you're gonna uh, have to select here just i'm just gonna tell you this real quick uh, if you don't have this menu here you're just gonna click toggle switches you see, if you have this right here, if you click toggle switches, it's going to show you this. And then you're going to select alpha matte. Okay, let's see how does it look. You 
you can work with the settings of the uh, wiggle path to create a really uh, smoother animation. Let's see how this one looks. It became really slow. Okay, this is good. You have to work with these settings to uh, create the perfect one. Uh, because I want to finish this uh, video real quick. I'm not gonna take too long to work with that. Okay, then uh, Well, the result is this. This is my dribble account and this is the post that I posted here You see we have the well effect here. It's pretty nice. Uh, there's the light mode here uh, There's the dark mode here if you don't have my dribble, I post uh, well mostly weekly and sometimes two or three times a week. So follow me for uh, ideas. Okay, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna wrap it up. I hope you like this video uh, and don't forget to subscribe, like this video and give me your ideas in the comments section. I'm really happy that I started it and I'm really thankful to you guys that made me think of this. I'm uh, gonna see you next week with a new video and a new uh, tutorial. Uh, you can ask me uh, what uh, tutorial you want to learn and I'm gonna work on it. Hope you like this video. Goodbye for now.